For the first time since Carrie Underwood revealed she severely injured her face when she fell outside her home in November, she's giving fans an update on how the recovery process has been. Physically, I'm doing pretty darn good these days. She wrote on her website, My wrist is almost back to normal. About 90% there, and the docs say that last 10% will come in time. And my face has been healing pretty nicely as well. I definitely feel more like myself than I have in a while. She also admitted that she has found some positivity in the aftermath of this traumatic experience. One of the silver linings for me in this healing process is the time I've gotten to spend with husband. Mike, Fisher, and, son, Isaiah, she said, I've been calling it forced relaxation. Sometimes I think things happen in order to make us slow down. It also means I've been home to support my favorite hockey player coming out of retirement. The real purpose of Carrie's blog post, though, was to update fans on her new music. She confirmed that her new single, which will be released April 11th, is called Cry Pretty and she wrote it after what she went through this year. The title refers to when emotions take over and you just can't hold them back, Carrie explained. It really speaks to a lot of things that have happened in the past year and I hope when you hear it, you can relate those feelings to those times in your life. It's emotional. It's real. And it rocks. To go with the song announcement, Carrie also shared the artwork for the new single, in which her face is covered in heavy makeup so no scar is visible. The country superstar also revealed that she'll provide another update soon regarding album and tour plans. Ah! Carrie will make her first public appearance since the accident at the ACM Awards on April 15th, where she'll perform Cry Pretty on TV for the first time. We can't wait.